Welcome to the application for the ODE 5000 Displacement Measurement Sensor. We will show you how to set up a glass thickness measurement on multiple layers with just one OD5000 sensor. We use an OD5000C85T20 sensor for the demonstration. In the specular mounting position, the measuring range of this sensor is 71.5 to 91.5 millimeters. Place the glass reference target in the target holder. In our demonstration, we use two glass targets with a thickness of 1.1 mm each. The thickness limits of each sensor can be found in the respective instruction guides. To access the sensor through your web browser, type the sensor's IP address into your web browser's address field. The SOPAS Air web server interface appears and the current measurement value graph is shown. To change the measurement settings, two actions are necessary. First, change the user level to maintenance. This is done by selecting run in the bottom left corner, choosing the username maintenance, entering the password main or M -A -I -N, in lower case, and then selecting login. Secondly, Disable the screen lock by selecting the pencil icon in the upper right corner. To assure the sensor is in a known state, select Reset under Factory Settings on the Device screen. Change the measurement settings by selecting Measurement on the left side of the screen. Choose the specular mode for measuring glass or other transparent materials. Make sure the sensor is mounted for glass thickness measurement. Activate two more channels by selecting the letters B and C and choose the measurement function thickness equal to or greater than 0.5 millimeters and the corresponding peaks for all three channels. Peaks one through four represents the transition from air to glass and glass to air. In order to measure transparent materials accurately, it is necessary to calibrate the sensor. If there is a substantial change in the mounting position, distance, thickness or material type of the object being measured, recalibration may be needed. To calibrate, we select I.O. channels on the left side of the screen. Choose A for the thickness of the first glass target. Type the reference thickness into the input field, 1.1 mm in our case, and select Teach. Do the same for channel B for the second glass target. Finally, channel C is used for the gap between the two glass targets. Type the reference value into the input field, 1.5 millimeters in our case, and select Teach. Select measurement values on the top right corner to access the values. In the last step, we go back to measurement and we observe the current measurement. 